This is a prop. It's not a problem. You alienated part of America. I alienated crazy people. You couldn't resist, could you? Jesus, not you two. This is a problem. I keep trying to explain that, but the president won't listen. Poverty is a problem. Apartheid is a problem. This, this is just a couple of... Here's the latest approval ball. We lost 20 points. We can get them back. They're at 20 points. I'll admit that's a little lower than anticipated. So you agree you have a problem? Nope, you do. You're the communications director. Fix this. Can you give me 100% employment? No. Will you get married? Fuck no. Then I'm thinking you're in trouble. Okay, can you have this naysayer assassinated? Not when you say it publicly. You're more fun as a gang leader. We have a country to run. Fun isn't part of the equation. There's a septic truck when you need one. Ugh, I hope Keith has some good news. Worst part of this job? Press conferences. Listen. We've got enough clout right now for one major bill, not both. What do you want me to push forward? Do you want to be the president who cured cancer or the president who solved the world hunger? As for hunger, mm, tell the kitchen to fix me a smoothie. Good choice. Hope Kinsey's got the peanut gallery handled. Now, you listen here. If you think you can cram your agenda past Congress, you are in for a rude awakening. You hear me? Now, let me tell you a little something about the greatest word in politics. Filibuster. Allow me to retort. Hey, Doris, we still playing tennis later? Oleg and I are about to head over to Camp David to watch some Nightblade. Yep. You down? Boom! Shit, how could I pass that up? I'm your number one fan! Nice work, Oleg. <laughs> nice. words were taken out of context. Kinsey, what's the right context for, and I quote, I'm the patron saint of America. We should probably look into changing the Pledge of Allegiance to one nation under me. That's a great question. Jane? I think we have a problem. Oh, not you two. How many times do I have Asha and Miller are waiting for you in the Oval Office. If MI6 needed something, they would send it up the chain, not fly across an ocean. They said nobody back home believes them. Jesus, what's going on? They think we're about to be attacked by aliens. I gotta go. This is serious. You know that Kinsey's been saying the same thing. When did you start taking Kinsey seriously? When the people who helped us save the world said we should. 
Alright, I'll swing by after I... Salvation within the Zin Empire. I'm smarter than all these people. Delightful. I do love your spirit, my dear. I'm Zinyak. Pleasure to meet you. Would you like to join me for a ride? Guns. Lots of them. Reports are coming in. I told them I wanted a gun in every room. And two in every hallway! There you are. Thank God you're all right. You okay? Where's Matt? Upstairs. Trying to find out what's happening. What is happening? All out war, by the looks of it. I'm meeting up with Matt. I'll be in touch via comm. Be careful. This way! What the fuck? Keith! Damn it! There's no way to fight a lady.
many of you are there? Bert to Ernie. Bert to Ernie. Activate South Portico defenses. Let's do this, you gorgeous thing. Enjoy leaping so much. Get off my lawn, you son of a bitch! You didn't count on me, did you? Well, hello there. Welcome aboard. I'm gonna have you stuffed and mounted, you alien fuck. Now, now, not so fast. Say goodbye. Did you really think you could stop me? Shit! Oh, human arrogance. Is there anything more charming? Fucking ass! Oh, I'm gonna... Do what exactly? Huh? Bravado me to death? <laughs> I'm going to have fun breaking you.
Hmm, something sure smells tasty. What a glorious day! Morning, dear. I made your favorite breakfast. Oh, Mr. King from across the street is going out of town for a few weeks. He was wondering if you could check his mail for him. Oh, and your friend Pierce called. I'm sure he has some crazy new get-rich scheme. Oh, that Pierce. Such a card. And someone named Dex stopped by earlier. I didn't recognize him, so I just sent him away. I think I heard Timmy deliver the paper earlier. Could you fetch it, dear? Sure thing! I did a lie, neighbor. I wonder what's new in the world today. Find people of Steelport? Well, <laughs> get in the car. Wait, don't I usually drive? It's your world. Go ahead. Ready when you are. Boy, they sure are anxious to meet you. They? <laughs> well, you do have a queer sense of humor. Is it just me, or does everything look kind of weird? Now, what's that you say? Just a nagging feeling, like this is all... Can't wait to get out to the lake this weekend. I hear the fish are really biting. The fish are... Huh? What are you talking about? Don't you worry now. We're almost there. Oh, careful now. Well, here we are. Why don't you glad hand a bit? We got time. <laughs> My toe! Can I get a picture? Aww, thank you kindly. That's quite an outfit. Looks like it's time. Your public is waiting. Oh my stars, it's the president! Hi, how are... What the f***? We don't use that kind of language here in Steelport.
What kind of sh** are you f***ing trying to pull? I wanna get the f*** away from here! Hello? Hello? Kinsey? What is this? Kinsey, where are you? Finally! Listen to me. No time to explain, but you have to break free. Break free from what, Kinsey? The place you're in isn't real. Whatever it's having you do, you need to stop. What? I'm just driving. Okay, good. There's a park nearby. Head there and give me a sec. Brace yourself. Brace for- Jesus H! I need some more time before I can get you out. It'd be really helpful if you could just, you know, just be you. Be me? This simulation is all about normalcy. Pleasantry, order, all the things you hate. Go forth. Unleash hell. Was it too much for you? What's in this now? <laughs> The simulation is resisting, but just keep going! You need to do more. Bigger! Hold on, I'm sending you something. Find the cat fountain. I left you a present. Gosh, this is swell. Always feels good to kick ass. You're doing great. The simulation is... Oh, no. Wait a minute. Wait, wait, wait. What, what's going on, Kinsey? Couldn't leave well enough alone, could you? You had to push and push and push. I hope you've enjoyed your last moment. That was fun. I'm impressed. Where the hell are- Fuck me. I should have realized a prison of peace would never hold a sociopath like yourself. I'm more of a puckish rogue. A rose by any other name. Are you trying to kill me or sleep with me? Charming. See, there you go, those mixed messages again. Then allow me to be perfectly clear. I am the architect of your reality. I build what I want. I destroy what I want. And your bravado means nothing.
Fighting back is pointless, my friend. There's nowhere to run. You belong to me. Now, on to more pleasant things. I'm going to place you in your new home. Try to run again, and I'll destroy your pitiful planet. Did you ever? My friends, each of you are guilty of crimes against the Zin Empire. But today is your lucky day. Today, you get to be a part of a new work release program. Swear your fealty, and I will empower you to be Wardens of Simulation 31. You will have one purpose. Torment the President of the United States. Beyond that, the world is yours to toy with. Ravage it. Indulge in your basest desire. It makes no difference to me. I just leave the prisoner alive. I want them broken. Not dead. Go now, and tear their world asunder. was different. Now where am I? Come in, President. Can you hear me? I hear you all right. Only, uh, how am I hearing you, considering I don't have a phone? I just patched myself into your simulation and projected my voice through the audio system. You should be able to hear me from anywhere. And you don't have to yell. Okay, because you chattering in my skull isn't annoying. Kinsey, I'm unarmed. Get me out now. I can't do that until I backtrace your signal to your physical body. Until then, you're stuck there, so you might want to go buy a gun. Great. Retail therapy at Friendly Fire. Thank you. 